name is day 306 I think and today's question is uh, what childhood lessons have I learned from the past now that's an interesting question because I don't know if one can really learn when you're that young because you don't even know necessarily the rights or wrongs of an action but I think one thing I've definitely learned is uh, <laughs> that um, being <coughs> sorry being a reader should be embraced because um, I remember I used to read all the time in the libraries and school libraries and it'd be pretty empty it's kind of sad but a lot of libraries would be pretty empty even today but that's also a societal shift in terms of reading from physical spaces into the digital world uh, so one of the lessons I've learned is actually it's way 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 better to you know embrace that side of you if you want to learn something go ahead and do it because certain friend groups they don't really they're not interested in that and that's their prerogative that's fine but if you stifle your own ambitions just because it's part of like a, a certain friend group uh, not only mentally is it gonna do damage but I think even just in terms of your livelihood and what you can show off to, to yourself and to the world what you've learned is uh, is sad if it's gonna be stopped uh, so yeah I mean I I didn't really at the time I didn't really have much friends so I can't really talk about like interpersonal skills and stuff but I um, yeah and also uh, play football or whatever sport you did because back in like primary school or early secondary a lot of people would would be happy to play sports together and it's a, it's a social thing whereas as you get older you kind of stop so maybe I might have to reignite my football habit but ever since my ACL it's uh, I've just kind of stopped but uh, I'll give it a go See you tomorrow.